You're preparing for a relaxing day on the waterway. Whether you're using a canoe, kayak, or sup, it's likely that you'll be launching at ramps used by power boaters too. It is amazing the level of stress often experienced at the launch ramp. You can help avoid tension by simply adhering to a code of boat launch etiquette. Let's take a look at a few things we can do. For those waiting in line to launch, probably nothing is more infuriating as watching a boater pull up onto the ramp and then begin the task of preparing the boat for the day's outing. Whether you haul your vessels on roof racks or use a trailer, you'll want to prep your gear in the staging area or a parking spot before you get into the line for the ramp. Everyone likes to make that last bathroom break before launch, but don't leave your vehicle in the line for the ramp and walk to the restroom or marina store. As paddlers, we love our gear, but once you're in the ramp line, your boats and gear should all be ready for launch. First, plan in advance so that you're aware of your surroundings and potential hazards. In sharing the waterways with power boaters and personal watercrafts, the risk of an accident is increased when the boat operator is inattentive, unaware of boating etiquette or laws, or is impaired. While you can't control what other boaters are doing, you can practice safe boating behaviors and lessen your risk. If you haven't launched at a specific ramp, it's a good idea to go in advance and check out the surroundings. When you're ready to launch, you'll know where the line for the ramp is, where the bathrooms are, designated spaces for trailers and spaces for vehicles, the bait shop, etc. There's usually lots of activity at boat ramps. Let's take a look at some of the precautions you should take while sharing the waterways with power boaters. At boat ramps, where power boaters and paddles are launching, there's sometimes a soft launch area specifically for paddlecraft. Use it. Power boaters need the paved ramp, and a soft launch is less wear and tear on your vessel. If there is no soft launch, you'll wait your turn at the ramp along with power boaters pulling trailers. Be aware that when it is your turn to launch, a driver backing your trailer may not see you launching your kayak. Give a wave or communicate with the next boater in line so they know that you are behind them. Unload your vessel and stage it far away from the paved area while you park your vehicle. If parking spots are located close by, it is preferred that you unload in a parking space and carry your vessel to the water's edge. Many boat launches include a dock area that is popular for fishing. Be aware and stay clear of fishing lines. Onlookers may congregate at the water's edge. Be aware of them while backing down a ramp. Many people are using cell phones, which likely means they are distracted. Remember that there is a lot of expensive equipment around you and safety needs to be your priority. We've learned how to properly prepare for paddling in an area with power boaters to include planning for your adventure by learning about the area, staying clear of power boaters by hugging the shoreline, wearing brightly colored clothing and life jackets to become more visible, and learning about the navigation aids in the area. Challenge yourself to learn more and share this knowledge to make everyone safer on the water. Education is one key to remaining safe while boating.